In today's video, we're gonna be covering the top 10 products for you to dropship in March, 2024. Now, all of these products are selected by a professional team of dropshippers with years and years of experience. Many years of experience. All of these products are backed by years of data. They are all currently trending and have market value. Not only that, but they have the two criterias that we need. One, they all solve some sort of problem and two, they all have a wow factor. Now to make things even better, these products aren't gonna sell in just March. They're gonna sell in the coming months afterwards as well. So you're gonna be making some money in March and beyond. All year round. Now, like previous videos, we're gonna have a cheat sheet to go along with this one. And if you want access to that, all you have to do is go ahead and comment down below, hashtag March 2024, and let me know which one of these products was your favorite. Once I see that you went ahead and did that, I'll reply back with a link to the sheet. All right, so right off the bat, the first item on this list is a pretty unique one, and that is a snail soap dispenser. So let's check out the TikTok ad for this. So the first thing we have is the Shein review that isn't closed. Welcome to another Shein review that isn't closed. So today we have a soap dispenser. It's actually a lot bigger than I expected it to be. Just by looking at the pictures, it looks to be a lot smaller. But being able to have a hand in it to be able to compare size is really good. Yep, it's a snail. So you want to take off his shell like this, and then you have this. That's interesting. I just love watermelon. So in this video, what they're doing is pretty much just showing you how it works. That's all it really is. This baby out. And he just pushed down on the shell. It's a 10 out of 10 for me, look at this. All right, I mean, the ad is super simple. All it does is teach you exactly how the item works, which to be completely honest with you, I was wondering how it did in the first place when I first saw it. And I really like the fact that she's actually holding the item. So that way you can see more or less how big it is. When I first saw a picture of this item, it looked to be a lot smaller than it actually was. When I saw the ad and I saw it on somebody's hand, then it actually made me feel a little bit better about being able to purchase one of these for myself because you can see that it's actually not that small. It's about the size of her hand. Now the ad itself, like I said, is super simple. The quality isn't the best. You can tell it was recorded just from one day to the other. You know, they just received the item and they did a quick video. But look at this. It has 387,000 likes. And this video is so simple. It just teaches you how to use the item. So I clicked on the profile to see what they were about to see if they were a brand or maybe if they were trying to do some affiliate marketing or something like that. But there's nothing. There's no links and there's nothing. The video we just saw has 2.5 million views and that's all organic. Interesting voice settings, lumpy space princess vibes, what? Now the comments don't really have too much to do with the actual item itself. They're all kind of just critiquing the video itself. But the fact that it has 2.5 million views means that a simple video like this can easily work to be able to advertise this product or a similar product. So let's take a look the seller's website and this is let's hopeful i think it is that, that's not a very good name the name has absolutely nothing to do with the item there's no correlation there's no relevance it's not a good name it's a very generic name that I don't think has anything to do with much of anything. But beside the point, the website itself is kind of giving me some Bed Bath & Beyond vibes, probably because of the color scheme that they're using. So because of the blues, the gray, and the whites. Now the product itself, they're selling it for $19.97. It has free delivery. And the actual layout of the website isn't that bad. So I like the fact that it's not cluttered. Everything is right here on the side, on the left-hand side. As you scroll down, the checkout stays in place. I like the fact that this is here, so you can check out some of the information on it, maybe after you read the description or you make sure that you can return it, then the customer can easily make the decision to add to cart. Now let's check out AliExpress. So right now it's actually on sale for 99 cents, but we're not gonna go with that price because it can always fluctuate, maybe from one month to the other, it'll just stop being on sale. So I always take into consideration the full price. So $7.33 with $2 shipping. So the item itself is selling for $19.97 with a source price of $9.32, giving us a profit potential of $10.65 for a simple snail soap dispenser. That's actually not that bad. Now with our Facebook ads targeting or with our TikTok targeting, some of the interests that we can target for our demographic can include home decor, animal lovers, and novelty home accessories. All right, number two, we have a novelty hearts necklace. So let's check out the Facebook ad. Look what I got my girl. And it's showing six eternal roses with a little pendant. It's made up of the four hearts and when you put them together they create a four leaf clover and it's magnetic so pretty simple it's just showing you the actual product it's giving you a nice little view of everything and how it's packaged now february was valentine's day so why are we showing you a product that has roses in it well simply because march is also saint patrick's day now i know the two holidays don't have absolutely anything to do with each other but the way that something like this can be marketed can be pretty creative actually so you can start let's say making a video and you can talk about or maybe you can mention 
It doesn't have to be you. It could be an AI generated voice, but it can mention somebody just, I don't know, forgetting to get a Valentine's Day present and their wife or their girlfriend getting super mad. So next holiday is St. Patrick's Day. People love St. Patrick's Day, whether it be to just go out and get messed up or to, you know, have some fun. So in which case you can supplement the gift from Valentine's Day for St. Patrick's Day. And it's actually pretty relevant for the simple fact that you have those four hearts that when they get together, they form a four leaf clover. So let's take a look at the seller's website. So here we have Bredzy. Same thing as I always think, the name has nothing to do with the actual product. It's obviously for a very generic store, so forget about the name, it has nothing to do with it. I don't like it. But the actual layout of the product page so far from the first glance actually looks pretty clean. So it has a high quality image and a simple title. Lucky Heart Sterling Silver Necklace with Six Roses. It gives you the different options here. It's selling for $21.99. Shipping calculated at checkout, which means they're probably charging you for shipping. Now let's scroll down a little bit. And then it starts to get like every other drop shipping website. A huge list of things on the side and just practically endless scrolling with a bunch of different pictures. Pretty sure if you've seen my past videos, you know that I don't like how this looks. It's too long. It's a bunch of scrolling. It's not even, especially with nothing here on the side. And then once you get to the end, it just gives you some relevant products and that's about it. So meh. the website could be a lot better, to be honest with you. It could be structured a lot better. At least move around some of the information to make everything kind of even on both sides and honestly you kind of got to chill out with the pictures here there's way too many on top of having all of these you have all of the ones here on the side so in my opinion if you're going to have a lot of pictures here keep this over here to a minimum maybe just keep something like this like a sizing chart and maybe one or two gifts and that's about it so checking it out on aliexpress we can see that it's being sold for five dollars and fifty six cents with a dollar ninety nine delivery now twenty one ninety nine for the selling price seven dollars and fifty five cents for the sourcing price giving us a profit potential of fourteen dollars and 44 cents now for our target audience we're going to be looking for people that are gift shoppers people that have anniversaries coming up and people that are looking for gifts for upcoming holidays such as valentine's day or saint patrick's day all right number three for all the wine connoisseurs out there we have a folding portable wine table Let's check out the tiktok ad it's pretty short it's only 13 seconds and just like some of the other ones, they're simply just showing you how it's used. Now, what I like about this is that they're showing how it's used in a real life setting. So they're actually taking this to a park, they're setting it up and they're using it. That is perfect. This is a great use case scenario because this is literally exactly what it's meant for, to take to a park and enjoy a nice day outside. Let's check out some of the comments here. So we have Alpaca Picks and it's got 23 comments. So it hasn't gone viral just yet. It's not a life hack, it's a tool. I need this tool, smart, where can I buy it? I must have this for my next park and chill ants but overall the comments are very positive people are talking good about it people actually want it they're trying to find out where to buy it and this is just one video if you can have maybe five or six different videos that all have more or less the same amount of views and the same amount of interactions then you're going to be accessing a pretty big demographic of people so let's check out the seller's website and we have iowa wine stay in the know get 10 bucks off and this is running for a whopping 72 dollars so it shows up top free shipping over $99, which means that it's not going to be $72. It's going to be $72 plus shipping. So let's add maybe about 13 bucks to it. Aside from that, though, the website itself looks really nice. It's kind of giving me total wine and more vibes. I don't know why, but overall, it's really good. The name has relevance to the product itself, and you can tell that this website is actually geared towards specifically wine or wine products or wine accessories. So let's check out what the rest of this website looks like. Here it has all of the information on the product itself. I love something like this. It's super easy to click through. It's very clean and then straight to the ratings which is really good if you're able to have ratings on your products i highly suggest you do if you don't have any ratings for it one thing you can do is if you're using shopify you can download an app called judge me or judge.me yeah judge.me product reviews so this can help you import reviews from outside shopify so if you find the product that you're selling on aliexpress even if it's not from the same supplier if it's the same product you can export those reviews you can take those reviews from the aliexpress page and you can put them on your product page the best thing is, is that it's also going to import photo reviews or image reviews so people that have left pictures with the reviews those can also be included which in my opinion is absolutely fantastic because that provides even more social proof giving your customers even more trust to buy from your website now taking a look at aliexpress we can see that this item is selling for twelve dollars and 35 cents and it actually has free shipping so let's do some quick math and 72 dollars as the selling price being sold for twelve dollars and 35 cents then it's going to give us a profit potential of about 59 dollars and 65 cents that is not bad at all now as far as the target audience you want to target people that are wine enthusiasts people that like outdoor activities and people that enjoy picnicking all right so this next product is taking me back to my grade school days this is a kids led projector so check this out so the first thing they're doing is showing you how it works so it has that little wheel that has a few different images and it has an led light 
Once you turn on that light, it's going to shine through one of the filters or one of the films, and it'll give you the image on the bottom surface. Then from there, you can just go ahead and trace it or do whatever you want. Let's see what else is there. And it's an erasable table too. All right, so it's pretty simple, straightforward, just showing you how the product works. And let's check out some of the comments. So it's got 34 comments. Wow, I already broke it. Oh, poor kid. Bunch of different smileys. Somebody has it. I want this. And just a few other comments. Now, overall, it was done very well. The actual ad was done well. I think the quality could have been a little bit better. Let's check out their page. So they actually have a few different videos with it. So they have this one that hit about a thousand. This one's only at 660. Oh, there you go. This one. All right, so this one actually hit almost 500,000 thousand views all right so the one that we saw which is this one right here this one actually has almost 500,000 views so the ad itself did very well a lot of people saw it it reached a lot of people simply because it was done very well it explains everything about the product and it shows it off perfectly now let's check out the seller's website here we have wanderlust pantry strange name i've never really heard of a wanderlust pantry i'm not entirely sure what that is but the layout of the website itself looks fairly clean it's actually very simple it's only three colors it's got the white and a couple of different accent colors being the beige up here and the blue but i think this is due to the button so it's probably just the beige and white now it's running for 30 dollars 99 it's got one review and scrolling down you have a bit of information and then a different tab for the shipping returns i like that it keeps the information a bit more organized scroll down a little bit aside from that they have a you might also like section so some product recommendations and yeah that's about it one thing that i would do different on this is add a third tab for reviews and import those reviews using the app that i told you earlier judge.me so let's check out aliexpress here they're selling it for $16.01 with free shipping and they actually have quite a few different variations some are a bit more than others and that's because some actually come with the table while others are just a projector so this can be used to project on just basic paper so the item is being sold for $30.99 the sourcing price is $16.01 giving us a profit potential of $14.98 as far as the target audience we're going to be looking for people that are parents people that are interested in kids activities and kids learning and development okay number five this is one that has been extremely popular lately i've seen it all over tiktok and that's a hands-free leash for your dog check this out so in this video all she's really doing is showing you how to put it on and telling you how she's able to walk a certain amount of dogs without even using her hands so really all she does is like i said she demonstrates how it's put on scroll forward a little bit attaches it to the dog gives you a quick show off and that's it straightforward straight to the point and extremely effective so it has 62 different comments my dogs would drag me two separate ways now the funny thing is is that that's actually the point of this product so this can help you walk multiple dogs or one really heavy dog because what it does is it gives you a bit more control over the animal since you're not using just the weight of your hands or the force of your hands to try to control them you're actually using your entire body since it wraps around you now looking through a lot of the different comments you can see that everyone's addressing one pain point and that's the fact that dogs can potentially drag you especially if they're bigger dogs but again this product Product actually helps you out with that so one way that this ad can definitely be a lot more effective is to show it in action not just show it in action but show it in action with a bigger dog so my plan actually for this is to order one of these because I have a pretty big dog and I have a pretty small wife she can't really walk the dog because he drags her absolutely everywhere so my plan is to order one of these have her wear it and have her take the dog out for a walk and record the entire process so that way people can see that it actually helps you with being able to walk bigger dogs so the website is Z dog.com now this website i came across it and i think it's perfect it is niched towards dogs the name is relevant to the actual niche and overall it's an aesthetically pleasing website it's easy to navigate it doesn't have too many colors and everything is very visually appealing now checking out the different items that they have they have a few that are running for about 39.99 now as you can see up here free shipping starts at 49 dollars so you are going to be paying for shipping for one of these so it's not going to necessarily be just 39.99 take a look at one of the product pages and the images are actually super high quality i love them i think this video right here or this gif i think it looks fantastic i think it's really well made you have the different options here on the side so you can see the different colors you have a sizing guide if you need it and overall the images are very well they're very high quality i love the look of this website here you have all the information you need on the product itself it's not overbearing if you don't like something you can just go ahead and minimize it you need to see the details or the returns keep scrolling you have the buy together and a bit more information on the product itself again 
and everything is very well put together, very aesthetically pleasing. Everything is easy on the eye. This website is hands down a 10 out of 10. Now on AliExpress, the item is running for $19.94 with $2 delivery. So it's not too bad. They have a few different options. They have the multicolor, the black, and a few different colors. Now on the other website, it's selling for about $55 with shipping. Our sourcing price is going to be about $22. That's giving us a profit potential of about $32. That is huge. Now, as for our target demographic, we want to target people that are interested in dogs, dogs accessories, and health and fitness. Now, before we continue any further, remember if you want access to the cheat sheet with all of the different links that I'm talking about in this video and the price breakdowns, just go ahead and comment down below the hashtag March 2024 and let me know which one of these products was your favorite. All right, let's get back to it. Okay, this next product can actually potentially save a life. So this is a very very useful product and that is an anti-choking device so pretty much what this does is if somebody's choking it helps you unblock the airways so it'll suck out whatever the person's choking on check this out now this is a very long video it's two minutes and 48 seconds so we're not going to go through the whole thing but just to start you can see that they're showing pretty much a real case scenario whether or not this is real, I can't tell you, but it's a kid that goes up to his parents. He's choking, they're freaking out. Well, first they're gonna try the Heimlich maneuver, a few different ways to be able to clear it, but then eventually it's not gonna work and they're gonna get the anti-choking device. Can't really see how it's used, but you can see it there in his hand. He goes in, he uses it, he sucks out whatever it is, and the kid feels much better. Well, not much better, but he definitely feels better and everyone is more relieved. Now you can see this is a very emotional video and that's what this is meant to do. This is meant to trigger emotions and specifically the emotion of fear, particularly for parents, because a lot of the times this is who that's geared towards. Parents that have smaller kids or just kids in general that could potentially start choking. Now let's check out the comments. It has 27,000 likes and loves, so it's really good. And it has ordered a home kit with three travel kits, a few different tags. This is what I was talking about. This item is actually making waves. I've seen a lot of people talking about this and it's actually been coming up on my For You page along with my Facebook ads page or the ads that I see on Facebook a lot. So. I actually do need to purchase one. Need one of this at the house. I feel like we need this, how to order. So as you can see, all the comments are very positive. It's people asking where they can get it. And again, an ad like this is actually meant to trigger the emotion of fear. So let's check out the website. Choking Device USA. That's... <laughs> All right. I mean, I guess it, it's definitely relevant with the product itself. Sorry, it's not a joking matter, but that's not a very good name at all. Choking device USA, but it is relevant. My suggestion, make it a little bit better. Make it something a bit more appealing. But aside from that, the website itself is pretty straightforward. You can see that it's kind of trying to mimic a health website or one of those websites that sells medicines, specifically because of the colors. So it has the different blues, but it has the LifeVac anti-choking device. It's running for $59.99 and you have the buy one, get one offers. Keep scrolling through. You have a few different videos, but they don't seem to be working. All right. You have some more details. So the specifications, what's included and the shipping and how it works. So keep scrolling and you have pretty much the rest of the information on the product itself and the reviews. So taking a look at AliExpress, we can see here that it's actually only being sold for $6.67 with $1.99 shipping. Looking at our selling price, it's being sold for about $59.99. Our sourcing price is $8.66, giving us a whopping $51.33 for the profit potential. Now, one way you can actually be able to make a bit more money off of this or sell more units is to simply undercut the competitors. You have a $51 profit margin. Take $30 profit margin and offer this product at, I don't know, $29.99. You're still making some good money. People are going to see that your product is a bit cheaper than all others, and it's doing the exact same thing. So they're going to go with yours. Just make sure that you get your advertising or your marketing down right. Make sure you make it emotional like that video we saw and try to invoke some sort of emotion in your viewers. Aside from that, though, make sure they know what this is for and how it's used. This is an extremely essential and potentially life saving item. Now, as far as the target demographic, we're looking at people that are interested in health and safety, people that are toddler parents and people that are interested in kids safety. All right. Number seven, we have an LED beanie. Let's check out the TikTok ad. Wait, is that a beanie? Beanie with a light in it. Yes, it is. So she's pretty much just talking about the beanie itself. I have it on mute because I don't really want to hear too much of what she's saying. But yeah, she's pretty much just explaining what it is and showing you how it works. It's really simple. It's just a beanie with a light in it. Oh, and she shows you that it's actually removable as well. and that it's USB charged. And that's actually pretty cool. I like that. Now, overall, this has 3,653 likes. That's not bad at all. 106 comments. What are people saying? What? Amazing. I need one now. Oh my God, so cool. It's pronounced. That doesn't matter. Got one as well. Wash a beanie, never in my life. I got my son the exact same button pink. So as you can see, 
it has positive reviews. Checking out the supplier's website. Oh, we're back at Let's Shopful or Let's Hopeful, whatever it is. So I already gave you my thoughts on the website. Now the product page, it's running for $24.97. I like the main image. It gives you all of the color options. Scroll down, gives you the description on the item itself. Not too much, not too overbearing. And yeah, hey, look at that. It's our snail soap dispenser. So yeah, it's pretty straightforward, just like the other one. The website itself has a random name, like I mentioned earlier. Now let's check out the AliExpress listing. It's running for $7.66 with $3.82 shipping. So sourcing price, $11.48. Selling price, $24.97. Potential profit, $13.49 for a simple beanie. It's not bad. Now, as far as our target demographic, we're going to be looking for people that are interested in hiking, camping, and nighttime activities. All right, at number eight, we have an elastic baby carrier. My dad actually has one like this. So let's see if it's the same one. So this is my favorite way to reconnect with my toddler when he's having a meltdown at three years old. So that right there is showing you that this can fit a three-year-old toddler. And apparently it makes it easier to carry them. It's pretty much straight to the point. It shows you how it works and how it can hold your child. Now, one thing I really like about this ad is the fact that it's not focused on a small baby. It's actually focused on a pretty big three-year-old. So this shows you that this product is compatible with smaller babies all the way up to toddlers. And that's one problem that a lot of moms have, especially the small ones. I'm talking from personal experience because my wife, again, she's pretty small and our toddler is about to be six years old. So he's pretty heavy and he likes to be carried by her. Something like this can really make it a lot easier for her to be able to carry him. So checking out the seller's website. I like the color scheme. I like this blue or aqua green. I think it looks really nice. It goes really well with the theme with kids. Now, as far as the image itself, the product image, it's kind of low quality. I don't like it. Some people might not notice it, but I kind of have an eye for these things. The rest of the images, they're all right. They could be better. They could be higher quality, but they get the job done. It's running for $37, free shipping on orders over $46. That's oddly specific, $46. Why not just round it to like 50? So this is going to be $37 with shipping, but then here it shows free worldwide shipping. So what is it? Do you have free worldwide shipping or are you going to have to pay unless it's over $46? Actually, I'll tell you right now. So the selling price was 50, 37. Yeah. So they do charge you for shipping. I tried to check one of these out. I usually go through the entire process with this and I try to check out with it to see if they actually charge you or not for shipping. And in this case they do. Now taking a look at the rest of the page, it has this nice little collapsible menu and that's pretty much it. No reviews. They should really be using the judge me product reviews page. That thing really helps and some suggested products. So overall, it's pretty nice. You know, the quality could be a little bit better on the website itself. Like this right here, hammered baby. This logo could be a little bit better. Everything. I don't know the website itself. All of the images just look a little bit low quality to me. That's really the only thing that I would fix. I'll just put some higher quality images. Now taking a look at AliExpress, it's being sold for $15 and 30 cents with $2 and 45 cents shipping. Now being sold with shipping for $50, our sourcing price is going to be about $23 and 50 cents. That gives us a profit potential of $26 and 50 50 cents. That's not bad for a simple piece of cloth or elastic cloth. All right, number nine, a multifunction faucet adapter. Check out the Facebook ad. 720 degree rotating splash filter faucet. So it's simply just that. It's an add on or an adapter that, <laughs> that's actually pretty cool, that can pretty much redirect the way of the water. So you can make the water go down to the side, up, back, whatever you want. The ad itself is pretty good. It shows you exactly how it works, shows you how to set it up, and all of its uses, which is pretty simple. Just you can move the water around to different places of which is pretty simple. Just move around the water, essentially. So let's check out the seller's website. And here we have Wholesale Prints. That's a strange name, but sure. Now, the site itself is fairly cluttered, in my opinion. It's got too much going on. I think the colors don't really work too well. There's not enough contrast between the white and the text. So while you can read it, it could be a bit easier to read. It could be a bit more pleasurable to look at. But we can see that it's running for $13.92. Apparently, it has 241 reviews. It's not bad. Scroll down. You can see your typical dropshipping page with a bunch of different images and items. I want to see the reviews. All right, here they are. So customer reviews, it has 217 five-star reviews. That's not bad. Now, whether or not these reviews are actually from sales that they got, or if these reviews were imported from a different product page, I wouldn't be able to tell you. All I know is that these reviews are for this particular product because it's showing the actual item. So I like that. I like the fact that they have reviews on here and that it's not just one or two. It has quite 
quite a good amount. This is another thing that I like, the fact that the add to cart button follows you, so that way you don't have to scroll all the way back up to add it to your cart. Now on AliExpress, it's running for 80 cents or $1.86 at least on regular pricing with $1.99 for shipping. Now that's gonna be $19.19 .19 to sell. That's a pretty big price point for one of these, but people are paying it. The source price is $3.85. That gives us a profit potential of about $15.34. That's not bad. Now, as far as targeting the graphic, we're going to be looking for people that are interested in DIY, bathroom accessories, and modern living. All right, so this next product is one that I kind of have mixed feelings about, specifically because of the marketing or what they're using it for. So check this out. So in this video, it's pretty much just a horseman watching a video on a very old phone of these little light up cubes and a little kid playing with them. So they're being advertised to him at least as playtime things. So bath time, playtime. So what he does is he goes ahead and orders it and he tests them out. He shows you how they work and he just dumps them in water. Now he does that throughout the entire video, just adding more and more until at the end, he throws them in a bathtub and all right, let's watch this. He makes it super dramatic link in the bio. That's really good. I like the fact that he did that just because TikTok at one point, I don't know if they're still doing it. They started censoring link in bio. So if you were to comment that they won't show that, or if you were to put that on your videos as text, or if you were to say it and it came out as a caption, then sometimes they would suppress that video. It sucks, but they started doing that for some time. I'm not sure if they're still doing that because I don't put link in bio anymore, but this is a genius way around it. And that's pretty much it. It just shows him playing with those same lights. So this is really cool. I really like this ad. It was super creative. And obviously a lot more people did as well. 4.9 thousand likes. Link in my bio to get these lovely ice cubes. You see what he did there? L1 and K B1 O. I started doing that at one point and eventually they caught up and they were blocking that too. Now I'm going to give you my trick. So every once in a while I do add in my videos link in bio or when I comment and this is what I do. So I'll put capital L lowercase L and then NKS. So I'll just put links, even though it's with two L's. So the reason I do this is because it misspells it and I don't put bio. So I'll tell people, check my links. That's it. Up until this point, it's been working. I actually check it from different accounts that I have. I'll go to the comment and I'll make sure that it's actually there. Now, the website that we're gonna be looking at is called Bright Meteors and they're showing this as an ice cube bath toy. And that's kind of what I have issues with. I don't necessarily see this as a bath toy for kids and that's what I've been seeing it around, you see? So it shows a kid here with the little toys around it. To me, it doesn't seem like too good of a bath toy for kids. It can be used as more of a party favor or like the guy did in a hot tub or a jacuzzi or something like that. But aside from that, it's being sold for $39.98. That is the 24 piece. Scroll down a little bit. I actually think we've covered this page before. And the rest of the page is pretty much just like all of the other drop shipping pages. Now for a supplier, we said we're doing the 24 piece. So the 24 piece is running $38.53 with $2 shipping. So with shipping, this item is being sold for about $54.98 or 55. And it's being sourced for about $40.52. And that gives us a profit potential of about $14.46. Now as for our target demographic, we're gonna be looking for people that are interested in party accessories, novelty diamonds, dining items and game nights. And those were the top 10 products that you need to be drop shipping in March, 2024, or adding to your store in March, 2024 for pretty much the rest of the year. Huge thank you to everyone for watching. Remember that if you want access to the cheat sheet, all you have to do is go ahead and comment down below, hashtag March, 2024. And let me know which one of these products was your favorite and which one you plan on adding to your store. Again, huge thank you to everyone for watching, especially if you made it all the way to the end of the video. If you made it this far, you obviously loved the video. So make sure you smash that like button. Make sure you hit that subscribe and ring that little bell notification so you don't miss out on any future videos. With that, my name is Mario with AutoDS. I'll catch you all next time.